Right, sorry about that, guys. Just got interrupted there. Right, we're back in. We need to look for these keys. I can't find them anywhere. I've spoke to everyone. I didn't speak to Duck guy. Let's speak to this guy. What's this? Let's talk to Doug. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Uh, not now. No, we could open Let's the gate, can't we? Around. Let's go out the gate. Okay. I don't think I'm meant to open this gate. I feel like I'm going to commit suicide. Oh, let's didn't do the cutscene or anything. What's that? Look at the hardware store. TV store. Trapped walker. Let's do it. Let's open it. Hey, man, <laughs> what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Where could the keys be? Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear uh, this. Huh? Everett? That's, that's his name. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? He could be a uh, kind of familiar face. Kind That's his name. Has a familiar face. Uh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know. And they start rotting and get all chewed up. And... Shut up, dog. <clears throat> Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. Oh man, now what do I need to find? Please prove that, that guy worked here, and then we can try to clear the street to search him for the keys. Yeah, probably easier said than done. Yeah, how am I going to prove that he worked there? Ah, I think I've got to find something for him and then you use the remote maybe to turn on the TV stores and then that'll distract him. So now we need Let's to find something. Okay. We need to find something that proves that he works there. Damn, I'm slow at these things. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's do this. I need to find something. Photo. Isn't that him? Doesn't that prove it? Greeting cards. Uh, photographs. Newspaper clippings. Alright, I guess that doesn't prove anything. I don't remember them very well. Okay. Alright, I don't think I need to talk to Duck, to be honest with you. I need to find something that proves that he works there. Maybe he's back in that door. What do I do with this? Not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Um, it's got to be back in that room. Oh, let's give her batteries. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. Oh, it's got to be back in that room because I have examined everything around here apart from Doug I mean duck let's go and do this is there anything that I've missed There's a photo, photo. There. let's get it that's him He's in the picture. It's his mum and dad and his brother. Oh, he's gonna cut his face out of it. Find anything? Family photo and paste. This one. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your <gasps> parents' store. 
Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. I gave you the battery, you know? So you should be my friend for life. I've got the photo, so let's go back out. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? Did you already You're kill someone? bad, right? I, uh... Why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, it's cheating on my wife, Trick. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Oh. My was wife he bad? was a hoe. And I had to he kill was. the man and sleep with the hoe. That was it. Hope you understand, Clem. Just don't be a hoe and then you're safe. Right, uh, we gotta go back out here. This is taking me forever. <laughs> How are we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Look Let's around. have a look around. Okay. Right, we've got a picture, we can prove it. Right. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Turn on the TVs. Knew it. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Fry one. <laughs> it's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Well it worked. done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Whoa. That got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. We need to put something on the TV. Uh, change the channel. Those TVs are on. And I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. The brick. There's a brick there. I can't reach that brick. Um, Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. So what do we do now? So that does that. Open sesame. That won't work. I was kidding. <laughs> it's universal, but not that universal. I know. So should I open it now? Don't Let's open it. You want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. 
we're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Right, I guess there's nothing I can do over here now. Somehow I've got to turn on them TVs to a show, I think. Right, I'm going back Let's in. Let's head back inside. Okay. I thought this game was easy. <laughs> Right, uh, we have to find some stuff. The cork board, I don't think it's going to do anything. Anything on these shelves? No ATM, no. Oh, what's that? Energy bar. Take it. Anything else that I need to get? There's nothing around here. I've seen that lady. I don't want to talk to her. He's telling me to talk to her. Talk to Carl. <gasps> the radio. The radio. The radio. The radio. Oh. Where do we go? Where do we go? Go around here. I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Thanks. I appreciate it. No. We found the batteries. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Um. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Am I doing the right thing? <laughs> no idea. What? What we got to do? Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready. There's to someone shoot. in there. Guys. Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. Then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can't. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. I bet he's related to him or something. Right. Oh, no. What am I going to do? Why is it showing me this view? Okay. Peek over the wall. And you freeze on me. Go down. They can saw me. Fucked. Oh no. <laughs> Look too long. Right, let's do that again. Click to continue. I reckon I'm gonna go for a record of dying so many times on things. Right, let's look over the wall. Look at the RV. Oh, wait. No, get down, get down, get down. I saw one lurking on the other side of that car. Is that look at the truck? We can hide by that pickup. Alright, we can hide by that pickup. What can we do by the RV? We can hide by that RV. If I go down. Keep our heads down. Hmm. Do it. Alright. 
Go back, go back. Nothing around there. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. Splash back to the wall. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. We're gonna go back to the car over Set there. Back to that wall. Safe there. Let's go to the car then. Go over here. But we had to kill him. She came with us this time, so this must be the right thing to do. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Go and have a look then. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop this guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. No, don't smash the window. We can't smash the window, surely. The door. Smash that window. How are you going to kill that one by the car without attracting the others? I don't know. How are we going to kill that one? Um. No, that just keeps looking in the window. He's not going anywhere. All I can do is the window thing. Do it. There's a pig in the truck. All, all I can do is smash the window. But that's going to be loud and that's going to attract him. Oh, I bet I fail. Oh, I bet I fail. Ow. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. See, that's not gonna work. Uh, what can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Right, let's go. I want to go back over there. I don't think there's anything I can do around here. Let's go back. This is just the RV over here. These two. They really want to get into that room. The only thing I can do is smash that window. It's the only thing I can do. Just go and do it then. Just go and smash it. I can't see of anything else. Maybe I'm just being stupid, but I can't see. There's a pig in the truck. I can't see anything else to do. Go over there. Smash it. Trying to punch out window. Ah. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. How? Get it quietly. Right. <laughs> How do I do it? I can't do nothing with him. Let's go over here. Peek over this way. All there is is that. That's all I can do there. Can't do nothing there. Right, let's go over here again. I need to do something with that car. Yeah, I know that. You before. Oh my god. Right, let's go back over to this brick wall, I think. Let's go over there. This is so difficult. 
I bet I'm missing something so obvious. Right, up there. He's doing that, go back down. What's over here? I've got this. There's nothing else to click on. Oh, what's this? A pillow. What's that gonna do? That's not really what I have in mind. Uh huh? So we've got a pillow. Keep looking around for weapons. A pillow's not really a weapon, let's go back over here. So what do I use the pillow for? Uh, can I go up? <gasps> I can use the pillow for this! What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. What are you gonna do with that? So, uh, I thought he was going to smash the window with it. Making a bunch of noise and none with pillows. What can I do with a pillow? Can I just throw the pillow at him? <laughs> oh, you can. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Was sick. Oh, cool. 